written by Anthony Taon, co-founder and COO slash CFO, Dexi Robotics We've heard the fear echoed time and again, automation is going to take away our jobs. And time and again, we see the same outcome, there are just as many, if not more, jobs in our more automated world. The effects of the steely arms of robots entering the workforce are likely to be no different than those of the great advances in computing that we have witnessed in recent decades. Prior to the pandemic, the world found itself in the unusual position of simultaneous AI adoption and employment booms. As The Economist recently pointed out in their finance and economics column, by 2019 employment rates across advanced economies had risen to all-time highs. Japan and South Korea, where robot use was among the highest of all, happened to have the lowest rates of unemployment. Is there any truth, though, to the seemingly inescapable cry that robots are going to take our jobs? Well, yes and no. The truth is, robots already are taking certain jobs, and they'll continue to do so. However, by and large, they're taking the jobs that humans don't want. Look no further than the hospitality industry and its ongoing staffing struggles. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, leisure and hospitality professionals were the only workers that saw wages outpace inflation over 2021. Despite that, the industry is still struggling to fill over a million open positions, a persistent reality that has burdened restaurateurs for over a decade. Further, it seems that higher wages aren't enough to motivate workers to remain in many of these roles, where fast-paced, repetitive, physically demanding work, and punishing hours provide little fulfillment and limited upward mobility. Meanwhile, these are precisely the types of jobs at which robots excel, repetitive, manual labor, which requires minimal creativity and problem-solving skills. Not only do robots excel in these roles mechanically, through speed and precision, but they also don't get tired, don't have personal lives, and aren't interested in career advancement, 